From world leaders to Hollywood heavy hitters and local landmarks, one local company is lighting its way through Massachusetts history. And as our Doug Meehan found out in tonight's Made in Mass, these illuminating items can be traced back to one of the oldest continuously operating companies in the state. Take a look. Just inside this quaint storefront in Chatham, downstairs in a basement workshop, Craig Souza continues the tradition of a Massachusetts company that dates back to 1836. The original company was S. Wilder and Company Inc. And it still is the parent name. S. Wilder may have started making hand pumps and lighting fixtures in Holliston 185 years ago. But in 1998, when Craig and his wife Debbie bought the company, the focus shifted to Chatham and Cape Cod lanterns. All of these pieces, all of these uh, collars and what have you, they all start out of a flat sheet of copper. These stunning handcrafted works of architectural art are Craig's twist on old fashioned nautical lights. Over the years, they've become the desired decorative lighting pieces for homes from coast to coast. Not bad for a guy who up until owning the company never made a lamp in his life. Well, my background was industrial arts and my strengths were uh, mechanics, <laughs> woodworking and metal. The Cape Cod native jokes about his auspicious start 25 years ago. First day we opened was in February. We had three customers. The first two wanted flowers for Valentine's Day because it was a flower shop next door. Determined to make the company grow, Craig continued to roll out the product and he eventually saw the light yeah. at the end of the tunnel. And where are these going? Those are going to Nantucket. Just as the parent company before him set out to accomplish almost two centuries ago, Craig believes his success is based on a simple philosophy. We're small, but we do. You know, I've gotten pretty proficient at what I do, and I'm a stickler for quality. Not to bury the lead here, but it should be noted, Cape Cod Lantons also called upon to light up one rather important cottage located in Maryland. Two of Craig's lamps have recently been installed at the entrance to Aspen Cabin, the official presidential retreat located at Camp David. I'm Doug Meehan, WCVB, News Center 5.